Looks like I'm that guy who has to bring sense back into the table again, huh? DJ, please cue the intro. What's good, ladies and gentlemen? It's the Afro Roni himself, Samurai Black Zack. Hey, ever since the new Yasuke anime has been announced and the trailer dropped, I've been looking all over social media and I'm realizing that there are some people who just tend to take their keyboards out and start typing without actually reading some of the, the links or articles that are being shared throughout social media. And most of those articles say, Yasuke, we will look at a his brief history, or should I say, get a first look at Yasuke, the first African samurai. And when I see this, I notice people are constantly saying, no, he is not the first African samurai. Afro samurai is. Afro samurai is the first African to appear in the world of anime. Okay, stop. There is a clear difference between a fictional character and a historical character. Let me repeat. Let me say that again. There is a clear difference between a fictional character and a real life historical figure. Now, I will admit, Afro Samurai is one of my favorite animes of all time growing up between my preteens and my teen years, no cap. And Afro Samurai is actually based on Yasuke, as in the, as he's based on the real life first African male to become a samurai, so therefore he's basically the first fictional African male to appear in the world of anime, alright, now, me as a guy, bring a sense to the tables, uh, yeah, bring a sense to the table. I see a few comments say, no, he is not the first African samurai. Afro samurai is the first African samurai. And here I come with my sensible glasses telling them, no. Yasuke, this is the Yasuke the anime, is telling a story about the first real life African man, man who went to Japan as a slave under the Italian Jesuits taken in by Oda Nobunaka after realizing that his skin color was not hot dirt and the fact that his dark skin was his real skin takes him in gives him money a home and a katana and gives him the rank of the samurai. Now that is one of the most notable and honorable things to happen in, J in Japanese history, no cap. So no matter where you go, there are gonna be people who say stupid, write down, I don't wanna say say because people, I don't really know who these people are and what they sound like, type. That's what I should say. Type down random stuff into the comment section and think, think, think that they're right. When in reality, they're wrong. Also, when I first saw the first the the first uh, Yasuke anime trailer, some idiot 
Okay, before I get to the idiot part, I wrote down the comments saying, yes, yes, finally, a historical figure gets to be in the world of anime for the first time ever. Right? Then all of a sudden, this idiot said that's because Yasuke was a fictional character created by Hollywood. And in my mind, I'm like, why did this say this again? Yasuke is literally a historical figure. If you look him up, just like Miyamoto Musashi, who is a real life Roni and a philosopher, you can look up Yasuke, a real life African male in Japan, born in Africa, went to Japan around, I want to say the 1580s, around the 1580s. Yeah, around that time. <sighs> but, on the bright side, I'm actually look, looking forward to watching this anime. Uh, that's all I got. Dropping my two cents. Have a good day. Or have a good night, y'all. Stay safe. And peace out.